The Rival is brought to you by 360 Hunting Blinds. Affordable, comfortable, and without compromises. Woodhaven Custom Calls. Realism Unleashed. Black Widow Deer Lures. It's simple. They work. Happy Herd Nutritions. Put them where you want them. The man, the myth, the legend. Bear Paw Hunts. Get it right. First morning. Let's get her done. Nice. We, we only want to hunt about 10 minutes if we can. We don't want to get cold. No, sir. I mean, what do you think about it? What's our odds? What are we doing here? Depends on what kind of deer you want. You got a big white tail? I do. Yeah. Multiples. Multiple big white tails. Multiple big white tails. So our tag is good for a white tail or a mule deer. This, and if we see a monster mule deer, we're probably gonna shoot that. But if we see we a are white shoot tail, that. <laughs> deer everywhere here. I mean, you you literally just you can about look any direction and see deer. But the deer that we're after, we're what what size bucks? Oh. Like white tails? Do you have what size? I know you have giants, but yeah. But I mean, I, average. A average mature whitetail here would probably be uh, 150 to 160 inches. Okay. And uh, of course, we've killed 190s. Yeah. And uh, average mature mule deer, I would say, is 170 to 180. Gotcha. And uh, killed 190s of them too. But uh, don't find many of those. Looking for a good mature deer, hopefully a hopefully a whitetail six years old or older that's getting out. We saw a little rut in action yesterday, so hopefully they're starting to get with it with this snow on the ground and everything. Maybe it's getting fired up. Hey, it's a good thing I got out and opened that gate. Jeffrey and Jason, they never got it open, but I don't know if they saw this or not. But there's a no hunting sign back there. Did you see that? We're already breaking the rules. That's a bunch of bull right there. These deer bedded early because of the wind today. Usually this time of day, with it in the twenties, you'll they're still really up feeding and everything we've seen so far has been flat on the ground, except for a couple of elk. So that means we're gonna have to use the use the old eyes and find them, huh? That's that's where I come in, right? Since I've been I've been mule deer hunting a long time now, what? About a year. The second day. <laughs> second day. <laughs> I'm a second day mule hunter. I'm a second day mule deer hunter. You're gonna want to listen here. I have watched a lot of YouTube videos. So we're so we're in between hunts. We hunted mule deer this morning, and now uh, Jason says he's got a really good whitetail. We're gonna try to go after, but they've been hunting this deer all week, correct? Yes. All week. So for five days they hunted this deer, and the man ended up killing a 145 to 50 inch buck but this one he thinks is a lot bigger buck and i told him if it, if at all possible you know yeah i'd love to shoot a big mule deer but a big white tail is really always takes the place yeah that's that's my 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 true love right. is white tail right. bucks so uh you ended up getting a little bit of footage yes. of the buck yes. that we're going to actually go after this afternoon so we'll show you here that being said, what's the deal with this deer and why, why can you not shoot him right where he he's won't, at? He won't cross our fence. He's got cover, water, and food in a 30 acre spot and he doesn't like to come out. I don't know if he can cross the fence. I what haven't do you, seen him do it. What do you think we can do to get him to, to cross the fence? 
just one well, of those deals. Hope he crosses. <laughs> just uh, it's hope a doe. Be, hope a doe takes him in the right direction. It's gonna be divine intervention. It's gonna yes. take God wanting us to it's, kill that buck for take, him to jump. It's gonna take more than we had the last few days. The <laughs> rival is brought to you by 360 Hunting Blinds. Affordable, comfortable, and without compromises. Woodhaven Custom Calls. Realism Unleashed. Black Widow Deer Lures. It's simple. They work. Happy Herd Nutritions. Put them where you want them. I'm looking at To the left of the two rooms. Okay, I see him. Yeah, that's him right there. There's two bucks. Well, the one I just looked at was him. He's in the brush. Yeah, yeah. Where's the other buck? Out in the field. Right behind. Oh. Yeah, that's it. Dang, that's a good <laughs> buck! <laughs> that's a good one. That's a real good one. Oh wow. Oh yeah, I'm 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 hooked. <laughs> you thinking every day here until we get him? <laughs> I'm thinking we're gonna be on him like stank on rice. Up to the field. Oh, oh we go. Wow. How good is he? He's, I don't want even want to talk about that. No, I'm serious though. I, mean, <coughs> I am too. He's good enough to shoot. I mean, he's a good one. He's a good, good one. We're screwed. We can't do nothing. Nothing. Where was he going to jump? Unless right here, because he's been in the backside brush all the time. But over there, he was to chase a doe out of that field, and they head up the ridge somewhere. Then we're good again. Not to mention this that, is just not like to mention that best one also has five inch brows. Yeah, I know this one's <laughs> this is like hey, this is This is bear paw hunts torture session where they bring the hunter and they show you the deer you want to kill And he's just not right where he needs to be to kill him Y'all this is fixing to get awesome. He's running across They're running He's going. He's going for it. That is him, right? Yes. Yeah. Running right to left. Yeah. He's running. What you think spooked him? I don't know. But I'm glad he did. Yep. Run, baby. Oh, I see the fence. Oh, baby, come on. Run it. My question is, who's with him? The doe? So. Why? Yeah, the doe's behind him. Will They're he, backwards. Will he ever cross that fence? Is my He's running right for it. There's a coat or a deer one back in a ravine that he would be headed at. Whoop! He's jumped it. Alright, let's see where he goes and settles in. At. He's probably not going to come back. You're legal now. right now if you think you can hit him from here. 400, you better see the liar. But that thing is a tight driver. If you, if you, we took, we close, ain't we? Yeah, oh, we're pretty close. I'm just trying to figure. So we get ready to leave. I'm just gonna pull up our turn around. All right, let's get, let's get directed. Yeah.
in front of that. I can't even believe this is happening. I feel like a jack in the box. November the first, baby. Get over here. I'm pumped, man. Oh, give me some. Get her done. Dude, I have hunted. Takes us a day. I have year. hunted, li literally. I have hunted in Montana now for a total of about 20 hours. 20 hours, maybe. Two different days. And that's all. And. I'd rather go for a whitetail. And he said, man, I got some really big whitetails, but he said, I got one in particular we've been seeing quite a bit, and maybe we can get on him, but there's only one thing. He's got to cross that fence. A bull, of all things, <laughs> chased the deer. A moo bull, not an not a elk bull. A moo bull, what's yeah. that? <laughs> the one that goes moo. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, that's a cow. I can't even believe this, dude. I can't even believe this. That is such a big deer. I'm so happy I could cry. I'm telling you, I'm that excited. <laughs> 